wow, it's a crazy world out there at the moment. I hope you're all surviving well. Um, but it's also a really exciting time. If you're a change maker, this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. If you have a transformation program up and running, if you've been thinking about change, this is it. With all this disruption in place, stuff's getting broken everywhere, you have a massive, massive chance to go and make a difference today. We, we spend so much of our time constructing uh, transformation programs and change programs to minimize the disruption. And often, no matter what we do, there is going to be disruption. We're changing. But it, it becomes this hurdle that we need to overcome. And it can be a reason for a lot of people to put off making the decision to make the change that really needs to happen for business agility, for better responsiveness, for pivoting around what it is that our customers are asking of us. Today, in the current environment, the disruption's already happened. Stuff's already broken. This is a massive, massive opportunity. If you've got a transformation program that you're looking at, that you've been trying to work out what to do with, that you've been thinking about for a long time, with all of this disruption in place, you've got a huge opportunity to get your agenda over the line today. So as an example, uh, if you've got staff that are being stood down for in one particular part of the business, there's an opportunity to transfer those people with all of that knowledge and context across to the another area of your operation where you're needing to resource up. Um, it's a massive opportunity for cross-functional team development. It's a great way to get more people on the front line, particularly if you've got a lot of inquiries coming in from customers. I've got one client at the moment who's in tourism and because a lot of their trips aren't happening, they now have a bunch of staff that would otherwise normally be out hosting uh, customers on a boat trip or a, um, or a bus journey. We can now take those people and put them in a place where they can do some good. And they can be helping out with our call center staff and reworking the bookings, reworking, um, making things easier for customers as the cancellations are coming in, as plans are changing and customers want to change. So my recommendation to you right now is to take this opportunity. Look at the opportunities where you've already got disruption in an environment and you can start to make the process change towards removing waste and failure in a system and working towards more value-driven work, definitely look at repurposing to, towards those things. Um, take the opportunity where you've got tech strategy that can build towards business agility. So how can you build in the process that's that's coming through in a way that means you can be more agile in the, in the future, particularly around some of that stuff where maybe you can transfer a skill set. Um, and third opportunity, cross-functional teams great chance to start pulling people from different parts of the business together, whether it be in a war room and a, and a, a task force, or whether it be temporarily reassigning people to another area of the business away from a place that is no longer requiring the input and the, the manpower, the effort, um, and repurposing them onto work that's actually going to make a difference for customers. So take the opportunity. It's not all bad. It's actually a really positive opportunity for those of you that have been thinking about making change, that have been thinking about transformation programs. So let's go out there and smash it.